What's that? Exactly. He's missed it. That was Mr. Gibson. So I made a video for you in the video. I don't know where it went. It's a gone. So making another one. So first of all, I just want to say I just finished a donut. And 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 all that money you guys gave me helped buy donuts. So third period, you know, I could share donuts with you, but you gone too. I don't know what's going on. Oh yeah, I do know what's going on. We're not gonna be in school for a month. So it's pretty weird, guys, right? This is this is one of those things where you will tell your your grandkids about it. It's a big deal. But it doesn't need to be, I don't know, excessively scary, as it were. Okay, yeah, it's going to be a little anxious here and there. But we're sending out some information for you, some work, just some ideas to help you maintain through this. Okay, some people are going to get through this stronger than when it started, than before it started. You need to maintain a schedule every day. Okay, if you just treat this like Fortnite all day and monsters and jalapeno Cheetos, it's by the time you come back to school, you're going to be a mess. I'm just being honest with you. So maybe for a day or two, you're like, hey, kind of a vacation feel to it. But after that, you really need to start thinking about getting back to work. Okay, no one's saying you're going to be doing schoolwork from 7.30 to 2.38 every day. Okay, I get that. But you should set aside probably two hours a day between math, science, social studies, English, whether you're reading for two hours, whether you do a few math problems, whatever the case may be, it's going to look different for everybody. You need to do something. All right, you just need to do something. I know my wife's got schedules for the kids at home. They're working and cleaning and academic time and yeah, there's free time built in for sure, but it can't be all just free fun time, all right? Doing chores, some academics, mix it in, um, stay fresh. So so what's going to happen with math is this. I have um, I've created a, an assignment in Castle. There's 100 questions. Now, before you tip over, um, I'm not going to expect you to sit down and do 100 questions tomorrow. So I would expect you to do maybe 10 questions this week or 20 questions this week, maybe 10 this week, maybe 20 next week, whatever. Um, and then I'll make a video going over those problems. And it's just, aside from maybe a couple new questions, it's the vast majority of it is, um, is review. I don't know what that is. Can you guys hear that? What's going on here? Uh... Okay. I don't know. I'm going to keep recording. Am I recording? I think so. I don't know. Sorry, guys. There's some weird error popped up, and I don't even know what it is. So, anywho. Um, but, so, I'll make a video on whatever questions I assign, um, and we'll just treat it like that, okay? I'll push stuff to you into Google Classroom. Um, the videos that I make will be in Google Classroom, YouTube. So, whether it's math or science or whatever, be checking Google Classroom. All right, that's going to be the major link. If Wi-Fi is an issue, we did send some paper copies home with some information for you. Um, but just be checking when you can. If you have to go to, I don't know, outside a library parking lot, maybe they'll have the Wi-Fi still on. Um, and check your check your stuff then. It's going to be a pain in the butt maybe, but we do what we got to do to get through this. So so just look for updates. Okay, I, I, um, I put out a remind here just to let you know about this video. And just, I don't know. Keep it real. Mr. Reed had a good idea about doing cahoots. So maybe, a, you know, for a period or maybe kind of more fun to do a whole eighth grade cahoot at once. Because uh, cahoot can handle, it's either a 1,000 or 10,000 people at once. So it might be kind of fun to plan ahead and do a, a social studies cahoot, a math cahoot, an ELA cahoot, whatever. So just kind of, I don't know, just try to keep that continuity we had a little bit to the greatest extent possible during what really is um, unprecedented times. So we miss you guys. Wish you were here. Um, we're going to get through it. We're going to get through it, all right? So put down the monster, stop playing Fortnite, do a little bark learning, and uh, we'll see you soon. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.